You got this. Come on. And you just, so hold on, go back, go back, go back. I just realized what your problem is. What? You have a harness on. I know. He pulls me out like this. He's got a collar on. You want to reach so, to do it. I'm going to just point this he out. He pulls me too hard. She's going, I've got a harness on because he pulls me. Here's the funny side. It's okay. A harness is meant for pulling. So you're literally training your dog to pull you the best that it can. A harness is meant for this dog. This is what a harness was created for. A husky and his eight brothers to go pull a sled. It puts all the power on the chest and then they're able to go, we can pull a sled, we can pull a sled. But when you're holding a leash on a harness, now it's, I can pull my owner, I can pull my owner. And you've got a whole different vibe. I literally just took the prong collar off of that dog. Same thing with this. You have to be able to show the dog directionals. If the center of gravity is here, when we're running forward, you can't teach the dog left or right, it's just pulling. So now, if you notice, as we go, let's go. Come. Jump. Look how easy it was, right? And it's because I can show the dog, let's go, jump. Easy. Let's go. Woohoo, come on. Woohoo, come on. Yeah. Yeah, you wanna be friends? You wanna be friends and trade? Oh, I did it, I can do it, I can do it, I can do it! Yeah, look at you. You wanna go in the A-frame? Come on, come on, come on. Look at you. Your dog can do 50 commands in under a minute. No joke. Incredible dog. Yeah, I, yeah, I Using the directionals is the difference between me going, nope, or me going, yes, right? I want the dog like it just did, spring, spring, spring. The dog will do it. If they shut down, it's because they're confused.